March 28th to Kishino. So we take Ladies a look at the tail of the tape. The fourth fight of the Eagle Next Level Early Preliminary. Introducing first is coming from Ukraine. Let's give it up for Mikhailo Sherev. Ladies and gentlemen, it's time to the red corner. It's coming from Moldova. Let's give it up for Nikolai Honda. Ladies and gentlemen, it's time presenting the blue corner, age 19, weighing 61 kilogram, height 1.74 meters, having a personal breakup, one fight and one loss. Ladies and gentlemen, for fighting for Ataman from Ukraine, let's give it up for Mikhailo Shev. Presenting the red corner, age 19, weighing 62 kilogram, height 1.72 meters, having a personal record of one fight and never lost, specializing Thai box. Ladies and gentlemen, let's give it up from Moldova to Nikolai Hunter. This is the last fight of Eagle Next Level Early Preliminary. Bounce weight bound under 62 kilograms. Five minute, three round, extra one round MMA rules. Referee in the ring, Alexandro Betcoglo. Here we go, folks. Our last preliminary matchup on the early prelims before we move into 
the prelims, which will be coming up right after this. And then the main card, our first of three parts. Overhand right, that lands right around the corner. Looking for a takedown, stretching out those arms, couldn't get it. Ooh, got clipped. Nice knees on the inside by the Ukrainian. Action so quick, back and forth here. Well, I'll tell you what, the knees are really becoming a factor here as the action goes to the ground. And it is the Moldovan fighter who seems to have the more advantageous position at this point. Caught in the guard here, but he's still able to get inside. Well, he better be careful here. He's trying to wrap him up. Trying to wrap him up. Readjusting. He's trying to cinch that thing in. Got to be very, very careful here. That right arm is caught inside the triangle. He's got it off to the side. But I don't care where it is. If somebody puts the squeeze on you like that, it cuts off. Uh-oh. Well, his head is stuck. See what he can do here. He obviously doesn't have it just right because he's not getting the tap and he fought his way out. He's giving him the arm though. He nearly had the arm bar. Maybe Hantea has fought through the worst of it. Oh, he's looking for the arm again. Oh, and he slips out. Another very close call there. Chetup had submission opportunity. Oh, he just got rocked with a left elbow. Another chiseling elbow there by Hantea. Look at the left elbows coming down. Oh my! Oh! Look at that! We could, the facial expression of the Ukrainian says it all. Those are crushing blows. And he's got the back here. He's got the hooks in. And he's opening up. Hantea! Just riding him from behind. Big right hands going in. And there's still two minutes left to go. Chetup has got to move or this fight will be stopped. A right hand, oh boy. Uh-oh. Oh, it's just a matter of time. Submission. He is down and he's not moving. I don't know if he's just emotionally crushed or if he was unconscious. He's still not moving. Look, he's limp as a dish rag. Is he okay? Well, we can see some of our special guests at cage side, but folks, I have to address the issue in the cage right now. It looks like Cherep is in some serious trouble here. He's not moving whatsoever. He took some heavy shots to the head. And honestly, that was very poor sportsmanship from Nikolai Hantea to be taunting his opponent like that. I think he was just so fired up from that incredible victory. He just couldn't help himself. Well, at least he's moving now. Yeah, they've got him stood up. But boy, he took some, uh, some elbows there that were just scary. Look at those right hands. And there's the choke. He may have choked him unconscious. The tap. And then he rolled over on his stomach and he just didn't move for a while. He, he can't even walk. Well, he's staggering out of the cage right now. Look, he, he could feel his mouth guard coming out and he didn't All know right. if he should protect himself or try to put his mouth guard back in.
Well, we'll get the official decision here in just a moment. Ladies and gentlemen, the winner is uh, by submission with a rear choke in the first round. Uh, let's give it up for Moldova, Nikolai Handel. Ladies and gentlemen, that is the end of the early preliminary fights. We'll be right back with the preliminary fights right after this.